Hello everyone, welcome back again to OnHow channel. My name is Enes and I'm working for you. So if you have any questions or any requests, make sure to drop them below in the comment or check out my Instagram right here below me. I do reply to each comment. If you are wondering again why is that, because simply I'm working for you. And in this video, I will show you how to change the sold out to coming soon on your Shopify product page. And not just on the product page, even on the collection page or the all products section where you display all the products or even on the product. For example, if I scroll down a little bit right now, and I see this product, it says here sell because I did that discounted price in here. And if you are interested in how to add discounted price, check out my channel. I already made that video as well as the color swatches with the pictures on them. As you can see, the, this is color swatches uh, with the picture for the variants that are based on that color, obviously. So if you are interested in how to add these as well, check out my channel. I did make that video. So what I'm talking about here, uh, if uh, the product here was sold out or was not available anymore, it will show instead of sale, it will show uh, sold out. So how to change that sold out to coming soon, not just on the sale in here. Uh, let me access a product that's already available, not available, sorry, or sold out. And I will show you what I'm talking about. So here is, for example, this product right here. As you can see, this is a short, long sleeve t-shirt. <laughs> it's weird, but I, I just named this uh, product for a video tutorial. Actually, I can't remember which one. And I did name it like that just for demonstration. And this is the picture that Google told me about the short, long sleeve t-shirt, <laughs> as you can see. So it's actually makes sense. It's correct, as you can see. So sold out this in here it says sold out and if i did access the product in here uh, it will show this button right here that i can't click on because obviously this is an add to cart button but because the product is sold out i can't click on it no more so how to change this sold out in here as well as the previous one that i did show you on the collection page or whatever how to change it to coming soon so in here it will be showing coming soon and in my next video I will show you how to change the color for the sold out in here as well as the color for this whole button right here which is add to cart how to change the color for it to a red or blue or whatever color you want you can customize the color however you want and I will show you that as well in my next video and if you are watching this after more than a day after it was this video was posted just check out my channel you will see the video on how to change the color for sold out in here as well as the button in here but for this video, I will show you how to change sold out to coming soon, either on here or on the product right here. It does show uh, coming soon, not sold out. And it's really easy and straightforward. You don't have to edit any code or anything like that. Actually, you will have to edit a code, but it's really simple, nothing complicated. And as I said in the beginning of the video, I'm working for you. Even if you have an issue and you didn't understand anything, just so drop me a comment. I will be happy to reply to you with the proper information you need. But for now, let's just get to it and show you how to how to change the sold out right here to coming soon. But before we start, if you are interested in how to add the uh, transparent header, just like you see right now, this is a video banner right here and this header is actually transparent. So the video is actually displaying under the header. If you are interested in how to add the video banner as well uh, as the transparent header right here, make sure to check out my channel. I did make that video and I make a lot of videos about customizing and making your Shopify store look actually unique and branded. And transparent header is one of them. And the trick I did show, it works on every team and every Shopify store. But for now, let's just get to it and show you how to change sold out to coming soon. So let's just uh, access the Shopify dashboard right here. So the first thing you're going to do is uh, head over to online store right here, then teams, then click on the three dots on the left of customize, and it will show you this menu and click on edit code right here. And it will take you to the code editor right here. So the next thing you're going to do is access the last section on the list right here, which is locals right here. So simply click on it and it will show you a lot of uh, JSON files with the language on them. For example, the DA stands for Deutschland, I think. Uh, I'm not sure though. So the next thing you're going to do is uh, look for n.default.json. So you need to find n.default.json, which is this one right here. So just access, click on it, and it will show you a bunch of code in here. And this is basically the language JSON file for the English language. And scroll down a little bit and keep an eye on the text in here, and you will see sold out. Or you can do Control F if you are on Windows. I'm doing I'm on Mac, or if you are on Mac, click on Command F and you will see a prompt and you can type in sold out and it will show you sold out on the text you don't have to look for it but i already found it as i'm speaking 
I already see it. Here it is. So sold out. Here it is. It does show sold out. So what we need to do is obviously change this text right here and not the one in here. Uh, make sure you do change the one in red. So I'm going to select it right here and I'm going to change it to hit that like button. Please. <laughs> so you can change it to whatever you want. In my case, I'm going to change it to, I don't know what's going on here. It's buggy. Anyway, so I'm going to click on save. So after you did change it to coming soon, or whatever you want, click on save. And after it will save it, we will access the Shopify product page and we'll see if that's actually working or not. And as you can see here, it says uh, hit that like button. So it should be displaying hit that like button instead of sold out. So let's just check that. Let's just get back in here. Here it is, it's still showing sold out. However, let's just reload the page. And here it is, check, check out what it says now. Hit that like button, please. So make sure you do so. And let's just access the product page and see if that hit that like button, it will be displayed on the add to cart button or not. So let's just check out the product page. And here it is, check out what it says. Hit that like button and make sure you do so, please. Because I did mention please in here, as you can see. So it will change them both in here as well as on the right of the product page right here. So it will change them on every page, on every section, whatever it says sold out, it will be uh, changed to hit that like button. And as I said, this trick works on every team, on every Shopify store. And even if you have an issue, so drop me a comment below. I will be happy to help you or reply to you with the proper information you need. But for now, the next thing you're going to do or the last thing you're going to do is hit that like button please so make sure you do so so that's how you change sold out to coming soon on any shopify store so it will be displaying coming soon not the hit that like button this is just a joke so your customers can actually see that your product is actually coming soon not completely sold out and as i said in the beginning of the video i'm working for you so if you have any questions any video requests make sure to drop them below in the comment or check out my instagram right here below me I do reply to each comment. If you are wondering again why is that, because simply I'm working for you. Otherwise, I take my job, but it's done for this video. So thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.